This is question 7 of the NBT exemplar. This question asks us to find the height of a cell phone tower given the height of another tower a certain distance away and with an angle of depression and an angle of elevation shown in the diagram. Because we're given the diagram, we can get straight into it. So if we have a look, let's just fill in some information that we know. So here we have 90 degree angle because 30 and 60 are 90. And we can also say that because of this Z shape here, that this is a 60 degree angle. And this is also 90 degrees, so this is a 30 degree angle. So in this 90 degree angle, we can label the side. So this is going to be my hypotenuse, this will be my opposite, and this will be the adjacent. Now we need to find this length, so that will help us find the height of the tower. So we can use the adjacent and the hypotenuse with the angle 30 degrees. That's cos of 30 degrees is equal to the adjacent over the hypotenuse of 100. And then we can work that out. Cos of 30 degrees is root 3 over 2 from our special triangles, which you need to know. And so we end up with our adjacent side being 50 root 3. Now we can use that length to work out the other side that we need by filling in the hypotenuse here of the new triangle. That's going to be the hypotenuse. And this is going to be the opposite side because we're going to work with a 60 degree angle. So we have opposite and hypotenuse that gives us sine of the reference angle 60 and we have opposite which we're trying to find over the hypotenuse which is 50 root 3. Then we know that sine of 60 from our special angles is root 3 over 2 and we can multiply that by 50 root 3 to get the opposite side isolated and then when we multiply this we have 50 times root 3 times root 3 which is 150 over 2, which is going to give me 75. And so the answer is D.